Hey everybody, and welcome back to Mission Control for a Quick Tips video. In this video, we're going to talk about curves and keyframe shapes. Using curves and keyframe shapes can give different effects and how the fixtures change between frames. This allows you to easily get more complex effects from your keyframe shapes. The curve types available, crossfade, which is the default, a linear fade between the frames, ease start slash end, a slow fade to faster at the end or start of the frame, Ease both a slow fade at the end and start of the frame with quicker in the middle. A bounce, a start at the end of the frame with a quick fade to the next frame. Snap, snaps to the next frame, changing as fast as the fixture can complete the fade. So let's take a look at that. Here I'm on version 15.1 of Titan, on Titan Go virtual interface. So I'm going to make a quick uh, flyout to see exactly how to do this. See our video on the classic flyout. So here I've got my classic flyout. I'll go ahead and add in captures so we can see exactly what happens with our lights as we change our curves. So I'll use the snap curve uh, to start with. If I was to change these all to the crossfade, we can see how it causes our fixtures to fade in and out in between the frames. And we'll go ahead and change our speed down to 20 to help show some of this a little bit better. So if we change our we change our dimmer back to snap, and we would change our movement to a bounce. Actually here we'll change this one back to snap and we'll change this one to bounce. You can see how when our fixtures come down we get a little bounce effect instead. We can also do that with dimmer. See how they kind of bounce in and out. And it's just back to snap. If we were to change it to ease on both, we can see how it fades in and then fades out. If I was to change it to ease at the start, or end in this case, this is the second frame. We can also change this one here and see how it changes the way our fixtures fade in. And of course, we change it to ease on both. Or if we were to change these to snap and do it with our, to ease both on our and a tilt. So that has been using curves and keyframe shapes to change how an effect progresses through its frames. I hope you learned something. Join us on Facebook at Able US. Join us here next time. Please subscribe. Thanks. Bye. We'll stop. Roger, we'll stop Discovery. Welcome back. A great ending to the new beginning.